Video 1.3 What is Node-RED and why was it created? In this video, we will learn what Node-RED is and why it was created. First, what is Node-RED? According to the Node-RED website, Node-RED is a programming tool for wiring together hardware devices, APIs and online services in new and interesting ways. What does this mean? Node-RED is a programming tool which connects hardware devices, APIs and online services in different ways. How? Remember, I didn't have to write any code to send an email. Instead, I added the green box and everything was done. That is the advantage I'm talking about. And that editor window we saw before was provided by Node-RED. There we can create flows using different nodes and the whole application can be deployed with a single click. And so, it can also be considered as a visual tool for wiring the Internet of Things. But don't get me wrong, it is not only for IoT. There are so many nodes in Node-RED and you can use any of them to create your application. We'll soon see those nodes I talked about. Are you familiar with Yahoo Pipes or Scratch programming? If yes, you would probably understand what I'm talking about. If you know about IFTTT, then Node-RED could be called as the engineer's version of IFTTT. Don't worry if you haven't used any of them. It doesn't matter at all because I'm here to make you comfortable with Node-RED. Now I'll tell you about the other advantages of Node-RED. The biggest advantage of Node-RED is its ease of use. And why is that? You would have seen it before in the last video, right? I didn't write a single line of code but had my work done already. That is the edge that Node-RED has compared to other programming tools. When I first started using Node-RED, I got myself into it immediately because of the fact that I only had to concentrate on the logic rather than wasting my time on writing individual lines of code. Mind you, Node-RED doesn't take away the need to write code altogether, but it definitely reduces it. You can end up with a working solution much quicker than by using conventional programming methods. This makes you more productive in less time. In other words, you can say that this lowers the technical bar to develop products and helps people to focus on the creating part rather than the doing part. You can prototype and develop products within minutes by just thinking of the logic. Node-RED provides the scalability from the prototyping stage to the development stage. Just as a spreadsheet lets you play around with numbers, Node-RED is a tool that's good for playing around with events. Other than this, Node-RED is open source, so you get a lot of support from the community. There are Slack channels and forums available to access help when needed. The other advantage is you can customize it however you want because it is open source. You can also contribute to the platform for others' use. The other main point is, since it is open source, you'll get a vast library to pick and choose exactly what you want for your application. There are gazillion possibilities in Node-RED. The only limitation will be your brain. OK, we've heard all the good stuff about Node-RED. Now, do you want to know who was the brain behind this? Well, it all started with Nico Leary, an emerging technology specialist in IBM, experimenting with drag-and-drop graphic tools to test lightweight messaging systems. And one day, seeing this experimentation, Dave Conway-Jones, a senior inventor at IBM, wanted to get serial data from GPS and use it with other messages. They know how to write code to talk to a serial port but it might take a little while to remember how to do it and get it written. And so, they started creating a node to get serial data and that was the beginning. 
they found the opportunity which would give users the agility to rapidly prototype applications which is what led to node-red's development at present node-red is a js foundation project from there they have developed node-red to work on different platforms like ibm cloud where it is present as a starter application or you can run locally on your laptop raspberry pi docker containers or android phones it can also run in other cloud environments like azure or aws we'll be looking into some of them in the next section and to know more about the history check out the resources okay In this video we saw what node red is and why it was created can't wait to try it out yet we can start right away after understanding how node red works and that we'll see in the next video